What is up everyone, I am Deviant Cringe, and today we're going to be taking a look at transformations. You know, those things when someone takes like a picture of a person and uh, puts them into Photoshop and transforms them to make them look like something else, maybe like a, like an animal or whatever, but uh, today we're going to be taking a look at uh, transformation fetish, yeah, because you know how it goes on DeviantArt, if it exists, there's a fetish for it, so uh, yeah, let us, uh, let us see what uh, we have here, shall we? Well, everyone, what do we have here? It looks like, uh, it looks like a woman being transformed into a, uh, I think those are donkey ears, and, uh, that tail looks like, uh, it doesn't look like it belongs. Uh, compared to the ears, it really doesn't look like, uh, yeah, uh, this is pretty much what it what it's like to be in the mind of a furry, you know? Like, when a regular person sees someone else, they just see them as they are, but a furry just, they want to imagine putting all sorts of stuff on there, because, yeah. A hot ass. Okay, I'm not reading all that. She wanted to be mad, but she had to admit she felt uh, strangely sexy in her new body. She gave her a tail and experimental flick and flattened her ears, exercising newfound control over them. She could get used to this. I do not own the rights to the original image uh, used for this photo manipulation. The owner requests its removal. I shall do so, the warlock. Nice ass. Or donkey. Hot ass, but don't forget the upper half. She is perfect. Just adorable. Isn't it? I'm in love. Can I have her number? I need her in my life. Oh yeah, you totally need a half-animal, half-human girl in your life, you sick-ass bastard. Okay, and here's a picture of a girl being transformed into a dog. So, um... You know, everyone, I can really appreciate when someone actually tries to do good uh, photo manipulation and all that, and, uh... This guy looks like they're trying, but, uh... You know, you can just see the, uh... Choppy-ass lines of the Photoshop thing. I mean, uh... They could have really tried to use, like, uh... The eraser tool or something else to smooth out those lines a little bit. I mean, uh, they are clearly visible. But, you know, other than that, it's not too, too bad, I gotta say. Furless snout. I think I have finally got the whole animal snout morphed down. It's not an easy, quick process, but with practice, I think I can be good. Yes, you can be good, you know, just to, just keep on practicing. Try to smooth out those lines like I told you, and uh, you'll do fine. Good luck on perfecting the snout morph technique that I wish you. Thank you. Nice and smooth. Thanks, that means a lot because bending is hard. Well, uh, it looks, uh, it, it, uh, yeah, I would call it nice, but I really wouldn't call it smooth because of this. But, uh, yeah, you'll get the picture. Okay, everyone, now, this is like, oh my god, Instagram dog filter fetish. Like, uh, off topic, I gotta say, the person who invented the uh, dog filter for Instagram deserves to be punched in the face. But, uh, this over here, it's like, uh, it doesn't even look remotely okay-ish. It's just you took you took a regular dog's nose and photoshopped it. It's like not even fucking uh, normally centered. I can already tell that it's uh, slightly tilting to the left, and it's like uh, this tongue is just oh my god. Like uh, on the previous picture, I told you practice a little bit more, but this you know you gotta completely throw this one in the trash. This one looks like. Oh my god, and I just noticed this over here, like, uh, this fur, or what's supposed to be fur, it just looks like, uh, like you found a regular picture of a broom on Google Images and, uh, uh, made it transparent. And I'm serious, this looks like fucking broom hairs, I swear to god, I mean, just look at him, it doesn't even look remotely like a regular hair. So hot. That's not the phrase I would use for this. My tongue! She begins to panic, only making the problem worse. I'm surprised at the lack of dog manips that actually show the tongue. Most of the time, it's just the ears, nose, fur, and teeth. Let's change those standards. I do realize there are some manips that do show the tongue. Don't get angry at me. Well, uh... Uh, this certainly is something, so, uh, I guess you can, uh... Guess you can chalk it up to uh, being unique in some way. Love it, I really like what you did with the nose and mouth to give it a pseudo-muzzle look, it looks great. Thanks. Okay, now this is just, you know, uh, this is just effortless right here. Like, how much you want to bet this didn't even take, uh, like, ten minutes to complete? It looks so, like, everything is just, uh, one, it's a low-res picture, which, uh, probably was taken without permission. Uh, like, the Photoshop on this is just, uh... I don't even know where to start with this. This is supposed to be hair. You're telling me this is supposed to be hair. And just take a look at those teeth. You know, it's so funny how uh, the teeth in the picture are like a lower resolution than the uh, actual Photoshop tooth. Uh, it's just so... Uh, it, it just blends in perfectly, doesn't it, everyone? And uh, this over here, like, this is probably the most laughable part of the picture if the tongue didn't already get you. Like, these are supposed to be ears, yeah. It doesn't even look like it's connected to the actual body itself. Also, it's not even in the position where the, where the ear should be, like, why in the goddamn fuck would you do this? You know, this pretty much uh, looks like a manipulation of what a uh, other can do to seem edgy and all that shit. It's like, oh my god, I'm showing my inner beast, take a look at this beautiful picture I did. 
Dogged out, another quickie. Well, Mr. TF Ghost, you are right about one thing. This definitely is a quickie, you know. Uh, no one's gonna mistake this for a picture that took, like, hours to make. Holy fucking shit, ladies and gentlemen, that face is pure nightmare fuel. Take a look at it. Now, to be honest, everyone, I can totally get that, uh, you know, some people, you know, they have a thing for, like, these uh, anthro characters, you know, like, uh, furries and all that. And uh, they like making... Uh, making these photoshops with real life people, you know, being uh, turned into animals, but uh, I, I really don't know why the fuck would you get uh, so aroused by the actual transformation itself, I mean, come on. Also, take a look at her feet, like, uh, why are they like this, you know, like, uh, you either wear shoes or no shoes, it's uh, it, it's so damn funny, I don't know why, but it's just, uh, it, it makes me chuckle right here, like, this really looks stupid. Pet peeves, ruining her favorite sandals has not been on her list of things to do that evening, neither was becoming a golden retriever. Could not resist the puns. I am the model and editor of this picture. All dog changes were painted using GIMP. Uh, Re-uploaded because there were some small details. I realized that I had forgotten before my first submission. Well, to that, I gotta say, you know, it's uh, definitely not the best, but it's also definitely not the worst I've seen. So let's just leave it at that, shall we? Beautifully done. You should do one where you become a golden Labrador and one you become a wolf. Thanks, I do have some wolves in my gallery. Just finished another this week, in fact. No prob, I gotta ask, what kind of were dog are you turning into the pick? And you know, everyone, uh, with these transformation people, everything is uh, were, you know, everything has to start with a were because, you know, uh, yeah, like, wear wolves, wear dogs, wear fucking hogs, whatever. How about a wear fucking microwave oven, you sons of bitches? This one is really cute, makes me want to pet ya. And take a look at his picture, everyone. He definitely wants to, you know, pet that, uh, half-transforming little dog girl, you know. He just wants it. He just, uh, wants that fucking furry ass. I'm just gonna keep all of your shoes for you. For their safety, yeah. Shifty eyes. Oh, yeah, like, uh, he's gonna keep all her shoes for safety and he's gonna fucking take him in his goddamn broom closet and jerk off in him. Okay, now this is just, uh, this uh, is, has absolutely no effort put into it whatsoever. I mean, uh, this is like, uh, this is like a literal Frankenstein nightmare fuel bullshit. I mean, this is like molding of different fucking animal parts. Uh, that tongue looks so bad. The snout is okay. Like, it doesn't look too, too bad, but, uh, the face is just wow, and the ears. Uh, do I even need to say anything on on this one? It, it just looks so. Uh, the eyes look like they're floating. It's like this. Uh, this what's supposed to be fucking uh, fur or whatever. Uh, it looks more like fucking mud, uh, if you ask me. It, the eyes kind of look like they're floating in the middle of the face. It's kind of like you can't really see any detail in the face, so it just looks like a like a fucking plastic mold uh, and. It's just... It looks like she's wearing the fucking scariest uh, Halloween mask of all time, isn't it, everyone? I mean, just uh, fucking wow. A good girl, too. Well, I wouldn't like to see one. 30-minute dogma nip. 30 minutes! 30 fucking minutes on this! Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? 30 minutes on this. It doesn't even look nearly uh, uh, of a fucking... Ugh. 30 fucking minutes, you gotta be kidding me. Sweet! And they deleted their profile because they were so ashamed of what they've done. Well, everyone, that's uh, animal transformation for you. Some are good, some are bad, and some are just downright ugly as shit. It's like, oh my god, that last image, you know, uh, 30 minutes on that, you gotta be kidding me. But, you know, like I said, I can appreciate, you know, when someone does uh, good photo manipulations and all that. Uh, it's just that, you know... The uh, actual premise of the picture is what bothers me, you know? Like, I don't know why someone would get a boner over a girl transforming into an animal. It's like her hair starts growing all over her body and her fucking face gets contorted into these different shapes and all that. But anyway, everyone, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and press the little bell icon. And as always, I'm Demon Cringe, and I'll be seeing you guys and girls in the next video.